yo what's going on everybody this is popular stranger and uh i'm back it's been a long time since i put out a new video only like a week maybe a little longer but it just feels like forever since i did my thing here on a commentary and, and recorded a video and a commentary for you guys so i'm back episode number 22 of my madden ultimate team series here on youtube and we got a head-to-head -head online gameplay. My team is a 95 overall coming into this game, and we're taking on a pretty strong competitor, a number 97 or number a rank, uh, overall 97 team. And uh, this is the first game that I was rocking with the Ghost Michael Vick card. If I'm not mistaken, I did mention in the last video that I did pick up that card for about 69,000 coins. Right now, it's going for around 108,000. So. If I do decide to sell it, it looks like it was a good investment. Um, and we got off to a terrible start in this game. You'll see the gameplay. It's a pretty long one, um, but it is, it, you know, it turns out to be good. Again, just a terrible, terrible start. Um, but again, thanks for sticking with me, guys, for all of those who didn't unsubscribe during my brief absence there. I hope you enjoyed the setup video uh, that I put out couple days ago like five days ago that was a re-upload i recorded that back in august but a lot of new subscribers probably never saw it so i decided to re-upload it and um as i oh my god i'm just getting upset at myself looking looking me giving up a punt return here so 14 nothing down already like i said terrible start um lost my train of thought there oh yeah so like I mentioned plenty of times before, I have a new work schedule. It gives me a couple days off in a row every week, uh, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday to be exact. So um, now that the holidays are over, I am not going to be busy. I'm going to have time to play video games like crazy starting uh, this weekend, well, starting today, tomorrow, and Tuesday. So excuse me, I think I'm getting a little uh, sick there. I hope it didn't gross you out with a little... Uh, sniffle there but um so i'm gonna be playing a ton of ultimate team uh really going after collections here trying to build up my coins um going after those those 2.0 team collections and we all knew that the uh the wild card playoff cards came out over the weekend and uh a lot of really good cards in there and, and a few that i, I really want to try to get one uh, definitely is the RG3 card because that's my style quarterback. Even though I, I hate the Redskins, I hate any, any NFC East team aside from my Eagles. Um, it's definitely a card that I want to get. And if I do happen to get my hands on it, I know I could probably buy it. Um, and I'll get to that in a minute. But if I, if I do get my hands on it, I may sell my Michael Vick card um, that I didn't originally plan on selling. But I, I think I might. Um, so I have a ton of packs that I already purchased and I did not open them yet. It seems to me, and you guys can let me know in the comments, that you guys enjoy pack opening episodes more than anything in this series. Uh, probably other than the giveaways, which we'll have more of those coming up soon. And let me rewind, as I always do in my commentaries, all you giveaway winners I have not gotten out to you and it's just because I've been busy. Um, so I will be contacting you today, tomorrow, and Tuesday. A couple of you are my friends on PlayStation Network now, uh, but I will be getting you your cards. I do promise I did not forget about you, and again, my bad for the delay on that. Um, but yeah, so you guys seem to like pack opening episodes, and it just seems like a big trend with Ultimate Team players, and I'm not knocking anybody, so don't take this wrong. Uh, but there's a lot of YouTubers out there who, I don't know, it just seems like a lot of people don't actually play games. Not only YouTubers, but, you know, I hang out a lot on the EA forums, the Ultimate Team forums. Um, so shout outs to all you guys who are probably watching the video that I posted in the forums. But it seems like a lot of guys spend a lot of time and a lot of money to build up these teams. And, the, and they don't play online or they only play the computer and I, I don't I don't know I don't get it I guess it's just not me um, but yeah there's there's some there's some people who are pretty successful on YouTube who get a lot of views and again I'm not knocking anybody I don't think they're doing anything wrong I'm just perplexed by why you guys like watching pack opening videos 
more than gameplays. If if you guys could explain that to me and let me know why, if you even feel that way in the comments, I'd you know I'd really like to hear your your thoughts and opinions on that. But my whole point of bringing that up um, was that I have a ton of packs to open. I have right now sitting on my account. 30 all pro packs to open, uh, I believe six legendary packs, plus some more might be coming, um, a key pack, plenty of key packs are going to be coming in the future as I get these collections done and those solo challenges done, but reiterating here, I have a ton of cards to open, and next video, I'm going to I'm gonna break it down, I'm not going to do it all at once, but next video, Maybe we'll open like 10 to 15 all pro packs and a couple legendary packs. And then we'll mix in a gameplay and then we'll uh, do another opening, pack opening and, and things like that. But So uh, I'm going to be going hard after these these uh, wild card weekend cards. I already pulled uh, three packs that I did not record. I didn't really get much, but I did get my hands on the Russell Wilson card, which is an, another quarterback that I, I wanted. So I'm happy I got that one. Really, my goal right now is to try to get RG3 as my, you know, my main quarterback and Russell Wilson as the backup. Um, that would be pretty nice. And if I do get both, well, I got one of the two cards. So if I do get the RG3, um, it's very likely that I'll sell the Vic, like I mentioned. And um, the other card I got up on the auction block, unless it's sold in the last couple hours, I decided to put my two-star Kelvin Johnson card on the block um, for two reasons. I'm worried that... They are going to re-release all the fantasy cards, and it's going to lose value. Um, so I'm I'm in the mode now where I think I want to sell it. I have it up for 145,000, which at this point is about 50,000 cheaper than the next card on there. Uh, again, this is a two-star uncollected Kelvin Johnson. So if it's a card you're looking for, um, you know, go get it. I'm selling it, and I'll probably be selling it for the cheapest compared to anybody else who has it. Uh, and the other reason I'm going to sell it is because I pulled a one-star Kelvin Johnson, and I think I'm going to use him on my team. Um, the stats aren't too far off, and I feel that I'm a good enough player that I don't, you know, I don't need super overall boosted, beasted two-star cards to be good, as my record speaks for itself, um, if you look at my team. But I am, uh, I am really building up my team and making some changes, and I'm, I'm going to ditch the couple legends that I have on my team pretty soon and try to go to an all-modern-day type team. And uh, I don't know, I'm just looking forward to it because I think with all the packs I'm about to open, all the collections I'm about to complete, and all the coin that I'm about to make, my team is really going to be where I want it to be uh, very soon. So I'm looking forward to uh, building up the team with you guys and, and taking you through the journey here. Um, and, and this gameplay is wrapping up. I had mentioned in the last video I was going to go on a little rant about uh, some things. And I kind of touched base on one of the things, but I decided to kind of call off the dogs, if you will. Um, but I, I just want to say this. I think the guys, the Mutt developers, the guys who run Ultimate Team are doing an excellent job this year. Um, I really get sick and tired of seeing a lot of complaints about you know things they do they they may not do things in a most timely fashion they may say you know something's going to be coming out and then it doesn't come out for two hours later but you know I, I don't care i mean just have some patience people but i think mutt is doing a great job this year i'm going to send them this video on twitter and maybe they'll check it out and take a listen to it um, so shout out to you guys you guys are doing a great job thanks for everything my name is Popular Stranger. If you're not a subscriber, please make sure you hit that subscribe button. If you want more Ultimate Team, if you want to be ready for some uh, some giveaways that are coming up here in the future, pack openings, all that good stuff, click that like button if you enjoyed the video. And uh, again, my name's Popular Stranger. Episode 22, Madden Ultimate Team. I'm out. Peace, guys.